Today I'm going to show you how to sideload apps on your Google Chromecast. Now you actually have to specifically ask to open the Google Play Store on your Chromecast and then you can search for downloader or you can use the link below that we have for downloader in the Play Store, hit the install button and get it sent to your Google Chromecast. Now once you have it, this is a very useful application for sideloading on the Google Chromecast. What you're going to notice over on the left is the word browser and I think this is a better way to navigate but they tell you ha you have to enter browser.aftvnews.com into the URL field in order to get this it's an extension of the actual application so you hit that and then it connects it downloads a file you hit install and the browser plugin is installed and then you can actually delete that little APK file you don't need it anymore and you'll get used to that process as you sideload now now the next thing we're going to do is go into Chromecast's actual settings, find the system menu and then go into the about section. Then scroll all the way to the bottom and you're just going to start hitting the OK button. You can see it kind of pulsing there. You're going to hit it seven times until it says you are now a developer. And then you're going to go into the privacy section, go to security and restrictions unknown sources and you can see downloader here and you're going to enable it to install unknown apps. Now we have to have a website and I'm using apkpure.com in order to find our different APKs. This is what we need to download in order to install or sideload applications. And the first one I'm going to do is actually called TV Bro. And this is just another application that you can use again to sideload. So you would have to go and allow it to install unknown apps. But I like using this with apkpure.com in order to download these different APK files. And you can see I'm going into Stadia. It says very clearly download APK. These are often tested with the different Android TV or Android devices out there and then you can go into the download section of TV Bro and you're going to be able to open that APK file and then it will install the app. So now I have Stadia installed and you're about to see Stadia working on a Google Chromecast through side loading and actually I'm using a PlayStation controller to do that and that's why you're going to need our whole video of tips and tricks or hacks with the new Google Chromecast. So go check that out. Otherwise, thanks for watching and of course, don't hate, automate.